Greetings, everyone. Welcome back to Just Cause 2. I think we're going to the final mission, but I don't know yet, but we just kind of drive up here. And then our little station wagon. Looks like a Ford Pinto. Which, if anything, this looks a lot like the old Ford Escort I used to drive for my first car. Oh my gosh. A fun little car to drive, though. Alright, let's do this before we actually engage the mission. Do not be alarmed. Forces of insurrection are at work. All armed groups are illegal. Flags of roaches, reapers, and eulars are banned. The chaos will be crushed and order restored. Our glorious leader has declared a state of emergency. Normal government will be resumed as soon as possible. Tonight's billion dollar lotto has not been affected, so tune in tomorrow to hear who is Panao's luckiest citizen. Alright, let me check this one more time. How many, uh... Let's do something with 10. That'd be a good one. There's an assault rifle. Right there. Uh, machine gun. Yeah, we'll do that one. Alright, let's get this party started. Nice work, Hand I. Cities are on fire. The gangs are running amok. Every man and his dog is attacking government forces. And just like we hoped, that sniveling coward Pane has fled the city! And you got a lead on that little runt? All on your PDA, good buddy. Baby Pane's hiding place. Not for much longer. Won't be easy though, Rico. Once you've flown to the canyon entrance, you're gonna have to go in on the ground. The base and the palace are heavily fortified. My suggestion is that you call in one of your best faction buddies for support. I'll do that, my friend. Though I won't need any help cutting that dwarf down to size. <laughs> Just make sure you put Baby to bed for good, Rico. Cause when you're done, it's time for a little of what we do best at the agency. It's time for a little regime change. Of course, now I remember. Barbecues aren't your only skill. Well, thank you, Rico. A man likes to be appreciated for more than his suckling pig. But choose your faction wisely. They're gonna be with you all the way to the end game. It's the devil's company. But I guess I'm used to it. Time to choose, amigo. Which one you like best? Savage Ular Boy Shri, Sweet Pinko Reaper Bolo, or Old Grumpy Roaches Dawn Razor? Your choice! Uh... There's the Reapers. I want them. Let's take the Winnebago. Driven this yet? How's that handbrake work? Ooh! Really good. <laughs> yep, Reaper Chase Q, okay. Oh my gosh, this thing's gutless. No, this is not the Winnebago for stripes. It does not have guns and all kinds of secret armaments in it. Still, it's gonna be fun to drive this thing though. <laughs> Take the camper out, war wagon. Yeah, this game is just a fuck ton of fun. I mean, the driving is just sublime, but the story is silly as all get out, but fun all the same. The characters are pretty colorful. It's better than Grand Theft Auto 4, that's for sure. This is like the true successor to Mercenaries, is the way I see this game. It's just. It's fun, it's got good characters, good writing. You know, it's not as good as the first person. But it's definitely better than the second one. They had a few 
good things about it, but for the most part, it's good. Thank you for helping the struggle. to cut some cane with me, huh, Scorpio? Thanks for the offer, but I can offer you something else to cut. Baby Panay's throat. I found where he and his troops are hiding. Oh, yes. Most definitely. You just show us where. At last, the people of Fana will rise and shatter the chains of the imperialist oppressors. At last, the hour of the people has come, Scorpio. Using your information, I have created a plan for the attack. I shall be leading the attack via radio. Being a figurehead of the revolution, I am much too valuable to the cause to be harmed. Farewell, brave comrade. Coward. Ain't playing around. Scorpio, lead our glorious revolutionaries on. They now have SMGs. When I pick up SMGs, they got pistols. Make up your mind, guys. What guns are you going to use? Okay. Move 
Drive me nuts. Just keep seeing a yellow thing on my screen. I'm like, God, Jake, get out of here. way. Okay, move in! We got 
Jesus. Okay, you ready, engineers and eggheads? Three, two, one, and access! Ah, that guy should floss more often. Now, Scorpio, <laughs> find the little evil this. elf Pane and cut him down. Okay, now for the leprechaun. There's a lot of ninjas in here. Quiet places. They always creep me out. I have been expecting you, the American agent. Please tell me you are not also here to steal Panau's beautiful black gold. Oil. I should have guessed. Always this damn oil. Oil, la. More oil than any reserve on the whole planet. I am going to control the whole world. Oh no, little man. Not if I can stop it. Oh, hell. It was you, Panay. You who destroyed the only thing I love. And now that Jade is dead, we'll die together. Imbecile. <laughs> Grotesque. I command you to stop. Get that grenade away from me. Throw it away. Dang. Uh, Jade's not dead. You could have said something. Oh, yeah. Jade is still alive. She wanted to tell you something about uh, never seeing you again.
of the dome to open the mouth gate and get out. Yeah, I knew that wasn't going to end well. I should have went up and dropped down. Oh, jeez. That's freaking garbage. I have a clear shot. Use the panel in the center of the door to open the mouth gate and get out. The dome is set to self-destruct. All personnel, evacuate the area. Self-destruct sequence, initiate. All personnel must clear the area. The facility will self-destruct. Where am I going? Come on, I was right frickin' there! <sighs> Jesus <Jeez>, Christ. <laughs> the dome is set to self-destruct. All personnel evacuate the area. Self-destruct sequence initiated. All personnel must clear the area. The facility will self-destruct. This is the end. You know, it would have been polite to let me in on some of the mission details. It's all on a need-to-know basis, buddy. You know that. Mm. I should have killed you back in the jungle. And miss out on that suckling pig? You'd have been crazy. Now Panay's dead, we got the oil, and I can get cooking again. Sorry, no time for pleasantries, boys! Country's up for grabs, and we got tankers from the superpowers all heading this way. Doggone! Guess the barbecue's gonna have to wait. No hard feelings, huh, kid? No, but just remember that when it's your ass on the line. Well, sure thing, Rico. Now, you just keep shooting and lady killing. Let me handle the espionage, and together, we'll secure this all for the good old U.S. of A. It's time to protect and survive, boys. Chinese, Japanese, and Rusky super tankers are headed here. All of them are looking to secure the oil for themselves. Uncle Sam sent backup out from every damn atoll in the South Pacific. I want you to patrol the area in the chopper and take care of any non-American dare stick his nose in. I'm be bad at Jap Japan. They're like one of our best allies. Why would we be bad at Japan? Sins. We got the coordinates for the oil field. You go in there, secure the perimeter, and await U.S. backup. Oh, you don't think they'll mind us blowing up their tankers and all? <laughs> Hell, they're officially not here at all, just like us, buddy. Besides, you don't want the damn commies getting their dirty paws on all that oil now, do you? Japan. Never did understand the politics. Japan's not a communist nation. They're, they're a, de a huge ally of ours in the Pacific. Why would we be mad at Japan? Anywho, let's uh, keep going. Heads up, buddy. We're getting some strange nuclear readings from the oil field. You'd best check it out. Oh, wonderful. Remember that missile submarine, atomic submarine that we saw first briefly? What 
uh, it's a doggone atomic submarine. Jesus, Mary and Joseph. Your bird won't last long against that sub, Hyundai. Better get down and personal. Missile launch. Bunny. You're supposed to be dead. You forget. I am invincible. Especially now I can destroy who and what I want at the touch of a button. Yeah? How are you gonna push buttons when your fingers are broken? You will find my digits are working perfectly. And now you die. I got one of them too. You'll never defeat me! Son of an orangutan, go back to your monkey mother! Ugly Yankee with long legs, I kill you! You stink of excellent little pig! all over the place! That's <laughs> funny. And he's dead. Mission complete! Ah, you think you have won? That would be my impression. I have news for you. I have four nuclear missiles ready to blow. So if the Chinese, Japanese, or Russians try to screw me, <laughs> well, they're in for a nasty surprise. And the fourth? What do you think? It is, of course, pointed at the very wart on the face of the Earth, America. And with this, I take my leave. <laughs> He's not. He's not. He's not too old. I told you, I am invincible! Have 
you flogged for this. I'll have them tear off your skin and bolt you to a tree. Your suffering will be the stuff of legend. Looks like you'll be spending some time with your beloved oil after all. New target acquired. What are you doing with the guidance system? Oh, just a few minor changes. <laughs> um, Rico, still ain't sure why you nuked the damned oil field. You lost your mind, buddy? The spoils of our little revolution. That fossil sludge would have started the mother of all wars. And you know something, Sheldon? I'm not gonna die in no apocalypse. Just so some fat cat in Washington can drive his SUV to the hill tomorrow. I don't think the agency's gonna be smiling. Do you have any idea how much that oil was worth? Sure. But it ain't worth dying over. Damn, Rico, that's as just a cause as any. I guess. Besides, who's gonna tell him? It's all on a need-to-know basis, right? That's right. I should know. But what happens to Penal? Well, since the oil's gone, all the others have lost interest. It's just us now. Penal gets a new U.S.-friendly president, and we continue to monitor our special little part of Southeast Asia. Home of the best barbecues in the East Indies. Got that right. Here's to a brighter tomorrow. Cheers, everyone. To a, a brighter, brighter tomorrow. tomorrow. Salud. Well, isn't that cute? Anyhow, that was just cause two. Fun little game. I will jump on just cause three here before long, but uh, you know, just want to keep this thing going. I got some other stuff planned coming up, especially the, the secret LP that I'm kind of working on. I don't know if we'll the time this is done. Probably not, but definitely not actually. But it's been fun. I am now hungry and tired, and I am ready to go get something to eat. And I'll start working on something else. And I'll catch you guys next time. Later. Who's there's any of credits? Oh, there's our game summary. Bleh. So mercenary mode, I guess, is just where you just go into the game and it's just free for all and you go clean up stuff you haven't done before. And that's pretty much it. So, but yeah, this game's fun. I always love the grappling mechanic How and all this stuff. Help you, hombre? Oh, that's not very mercenary mode. Mercenary mode. completed just cause two. There are still plenty of things to do. Uh, can you reach 100%? And that is actually doing every freaking thing in the game. Like, I'm not even kidding. Everything. Finding everything. Doing everything. Ugh. That ain't gonna happen. But anyways, I appreciate everyone for watching. And I'll catch you all on the next one. I'll see you then. Later!